Hello and welcome to the introductory video walkthrough of the Check Your Performance Measures Data or CYPMD portal. These videos are designed to help schools and colleges complete the 2025 Key Stage 4 June checking exercise. There will be six videos in total. Other videos are how to check your pupil list, how to request a pupil inclusion amendment, how to request a pupil removal amendment, how to edit or delete a request, and how to submit your school's full return summary. When we refer to schools in these videos, we mean any type of establishment eligible to engage with the Key Stage 4 June Checking Exercise. The 2025 Key Stage 4 June Checking Exercise will be the only opportunity for all state-funded schools, independent schools and FE colleges with 14 to 16 provision to check that we have attributed the correct Key Stage 4 pupils for the purposes of calculating 2024 to 25 performance measures. All school types should participate in the June Checking Exercise. Before we begin, it's important that you read the 2025 Key Stage 4 June Checking Exercise Guidance, the 2024 Key Stage 4 June Checking Exercise Request Summary and the How To Guide, which are available on the CYPMD Help Centre prior to you accessing the CYPMD portal. Now let us begin. The CYPMD portal has a similar look and feel to other online services that the department uses to interact with schools. It has also been designed to improve accessibility and provide clear navigation. The CYPMD portal will be accessible to any person in your school with a DFE sign-in account. For more information or if you have issues logging on to the DFE sign-in website, please contact the DFE sign-in team directly. Please access the CYPMD portal from the link on the CYPMD Help Centre. Click the Start button. You will now see the DFE sign-in page. Please click Sign In. You will need to select the correct school from the list if you have access to more than one, and then click Continue. The next video will show you how to check your pupil list.